In seat number two, former German international goalkeeper Ooh, Uli Stein. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think Udi's let in uh, four goals in three years for Germany, which probably makes him uh, the most prolific goal letter in of all German goalkeepers, but it's still a hell of a record. Uli, a bit of a five card draw player as well, and completing this Legends lineup in seat number one from Northern Ireland, Norman Whiteside. Well, Norman's uh, like a hero in Ireland. I mean, I, they, they can't say enough about this guy. He played in the World Cup when he was 16. He, he scored a winning goal in the Cup Final from Manchester United. I mean, you know, like when you talk about legends, even in an Irish sense, uh, th this guy is it. All six of these players will be joining with two pros from their country in the main draw of this event. But tonight, they're battling it out alone. We're looking at those chips there. Players beginning with 100,000 each. The yellow's worth a thousand, the blue's worth two, and the red's the big boys at five thousand each. <whistles> Regular time underway now. Mad Marty Wilson <laughs> kicking <laughs> off with the whistle. <laughs> it's it's probably his best game. <laughs> <laughs> and Bar, of course, there is a trophy at stake here, but it's also a great opportunity for these football players to get used to the feel of this tournament before they get thrown into the main draw with the pros. You know, some of these are going to be playing in the international teams, but uh, uh, Tony Cascarino is an obvious favorite here because uh, Tony can play to professional standards and, uh, and does do so. Cool. Cool. Two. Raise, 2,000 more. 3,000 total. And look what Norman Whiteside has picked up the very first hand park, two kings. Well, Norman Whiteside has been a lucky guy all his life uh, until he got injured. Well, <laughs> it's Norman's first time playing poker, and uh, he's not shy. Knows the kings are good and has raised with them. Call by Alan Ball, and we're ready for a flop. Well, I'd always be a little bit suspicious when a guy from Belfast says that he hasn't played the game before. I mean, Belfast is probably the gambling uh, capital of, uh, of Europe. I mean, these guys, I mean, pitch and toss, the dogs, horses, everything. I mean... Uh, I, I, I refuse to believe Whiteside hasn't played before. Mm. Well, he looks like a pro right now. Two kings, and the bet cool. is 6,000. Called by Alan Ball, who needs to hit a three or a five here. It's a pretty loose call by uh, Alan, but it's... Right. Oh, my God. Well, it seems to It's, a, it's a great call from Alan. <laughs> 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 the striker has struck, and what is going to happen to Norman Whiteside now? He's bet 6,000. Will Alan know to raise? Well, Alan has, uh, has called on the button, so... Uh, You'd Raised be entitled to think to that he didn't 000. have a three. Oh, he's only made a 12,000. He's, he's, uh, <coughs> oh, he's given call. Norman a chance to hang himself here. To call. Call. This uh, like a, a lot of professional players would hang themselves in Norman's spot. This pot big, 43,000 already, and only a king can bail Norman Whiteside yeah. out on the river. It hasn't come. That may slow the action down, Barn. Well, it, it may stop Norman losing too many chips here. <coughs> <coughs> Alan Ball will have to stop and think of what did Norman call him, but uh, it's probably more likely he's called him with a jack than uh, with, with, with no repair. Yeah, yeah. 6,000. Oh, the funny thing is if Norman bet a little bit more here, it'd be very hard for Alan to call him. Six. And raise 15,000. Well, yeah. <laughs> 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 raise 15,000 more. It shows what I know. <laughs> Alan Ball showing no fear at all. He has raised 15,000 more. This pot tremendous for the first hand. 85,000 in there and a full house for Alan Ball. A bit unlucky here for Norman Whiteside Park. Well, <laughs> the first hand at the tournament is but that's Barry Kings. It's a he can, he can, uh, he's entitled to feel a little bit unlucky here. Let's see how the cards rank in Hold'em. Each five card poker hand falls into the official ranking of hands. At the bottom is high card only. Then one pair alone. Two pair is higher still. Three of a kind, self-explanatory. A straight is five cards in a row of any suit. Ace can play high or low there. A flush, five cards of the same suit in any order. A full house is three of a kind plus a pair. Four of a kind is all of a number. A straight flush is five in a row, all the same suit, and a royal flush in the highest hand you can make. That is a straight flush, ace high. <laughs> Norman Whiteside first up. Oh. He's been hit once. Pass. And now Pass. clamoring back in it with the two fives. A thousand to call on Cascarino's button. Cool. Cool. 
Check. Or you can raise. Check oh. means you just I'll check. Go for it. Check. That's, That's a, a wise decision yeah, by Ray Stewart. Not much to look at, but he's in for free. Not a big hand at Scotland. Now, Ray Stewart probably holds uh, an unbelievable record among uh, Scottish left full backs and the, the, the number of squads he was picked for and the number of international caps uh, he's got that don't King, really match up. Queen, King. Check or back? Uh, check. Check. <laughs> Alan Ball has flopped two pair here. Boy, he's getting the hands and betting them strong. Well, it's a bit like the way he played the game. 10,000. He's asking a serious question oh. of him. Uh, Norm's liable to get a little bit of trouble here. Norman says he doesn't believe, doesn't but unless a five oh. comes, he's in terrible shape. And Ray Stewart actually in worse shape than Norman Whiteside, <laughs> if that's possible. <laughs> but uh, possible. Well, it's, it's, a, straight. it's a pretty loose call uh, by, call by the, the king may get everybody out of trouble here. <coughs> Full house now for both Alan Ball and Norman Whiteside. Unfortunately, um, that king part meant that Norman check. Whiteside now drawing dead, as is... 15,000. Ray Stewart. They could both split the pot with another queen well, pot. Well, Norman Whiteside, he can only beat a bluff here. So he, he's, he's got to be thinking, if he calls this, that, uh, that mm. Alan has got uh, uh, nothing. You know, th this call. isn't the worst call, call of all time. Raise it up. It's a fold. Pass. Pass. Well, the problem for Norman also, Parg, I mean, he has a full house. Uh, first time playing Hold'em, full house may be a very tough poker hand to fold. Uh, he's only out here. If a king comes here, he can split the pot. Three. King or queen, it has not happened. And will Alan Ball take maximum advantage? Three <laughs> looks like an innocuous <laughs> card. Uh, I don't think Norm was going to have to call this. He's, he's just a little bit unlucky that he's. Uh, some money off you. <laughs> <laughs> well, this 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 pot is big already, mm. and yeah, this will well, be most of Norman's chips. Well, he has to call. I mean, uh, it's either uh, either Ellen's bluffing or he isn't, basically. Yeah, I'm going for it. Call. Full boat on full boat. Okay, but Alan Ball's Hi, boat is bigger. It's no dinghy. Kings full of queens going to take the money. Whiteside will be kings. reeling here. On the football pitch, you've got to know what you're doing when the ball comes to you, or even before the ball comes to you. So it's a bit like in the poker table. It seems to me that you've got to, like, you know, you're trying to get into people's heads. What, what are they thinking? So um, hopefully I'll have my thinking head on today. <laughs> And Tony Cascarino, who's been ducking and diving so far, again. raising again. Total. Fold. It's quite a little bad oh. Oh. Tony Cascarino Pass. running some big hands. <laughs> this game's getting very, very <laughs> sneaky. Pass. Man, Alan Ball just called with the Queens. I mean, they're, they're really putting it up to Tony Cascarino. Yeah. <laughs> they're letting him hang himself, aren't they? <laughs> Here comes mm -hmm. the flop. Cascarino looking for the ace. He missed the first spot to hang himself here. Yeah. Oh, oh no. my God! Oh, no, no. Two, I mean, five. it's 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 mathematically impossible for Tony to think that he's not in front here. You know, Four, this looks like a great hand for the for the ace. Oh, oh yeah, Four. just call. Tony could end up doing all his chips here, Park. Alan Ball's got the goods. Ace. Oh, oh my God. This Alan Ball has just played himself into trouble. 10,000. Tony Cascarino wasting no time getting busy with the Reds. 10,000. Well, it's a nice, it's a nice bet from Tony. You know, he's bet on the 10 2 5 flop, but then all of a sudden an ace has come and he's come out betting again. You know, it's uh, you know, Alan's quite entitled to think that uh, right. Tony's got very little here. 20,000. Is he getting greedy? Will Alan Ball pay off 20000 here? Does he want to see the cards? I think he would. You know, it's, uh, they both played this pot very, very sneaky. It's very hard for... Uh, it, it was obviously very hard for Tony to know what Alan had here, but uh, likewise, it's a bit tricky for Alan to work out what Tony's up to. Have a look, says Alan Ball. He's not going to like what he sees. And when the cards get turned over, Tony Cascarino will realize just how fortunate...